What's up? How are you guys this week? Yet another Monday down at Frankie's Free Range Meat. And the big news this week is major price reduction on the eggs. You know, so initially when we started, we thought we'd have more breakage, we'd have some issues shipping them, but we don't. So we have the most affordable corn and soy free pasture raised chicken, duck, and quail eggs available on both frankiesrangemeat.com and then frankiesrangefoods.com. We have a lower quantity if you guys would like to order those. So definitely check out the website and, uh, <laughs> you know, my Amish farmer isn't too happy because, uh, you know, we were selling a lot of eggs like two or three months ago and now he has a surplus. So, you know, we want to keep them consistently moving for him. So if you guys didn't buy the eggs in the past, definitely check them out now. Uh, we also got some bigger boxes. So we're putting more padding in them to prevent the breakage. And if you guys still have any issues whatsoever with the eggs breaking, we're just going to get like double or triple corrugated boxes, which are really, really expensive. But then the eggs will definitely not break. I would say maybe, you know, one to 2% of the orders have an issue right now, but we always refund you guys if you email us and let us know how many eggs are broken. But uh, enough about the eggs for now. So let's take a quick look around and show you guys what else is going on this week. So my guys have packed up most of the meat orders this week. We got plenty of eggs packed up for you guys. Everything going out today, Monday, more meat orders, more eggs, more meat orders. My guys, uh, we're having a little too much fun with the, uh, <laughs> the, the Tatomi's cookies joke. So uh, we have the regular chocolate chip cookies in stock now on Frankie's Free Range Foods. So the first thing I wanted to show you guys this week was the fresh veal. Uh, I think we have about 10 packages left maybe not but uh, I'm gonna roll the clip I recorded last week of uh, all the fresh veal coming in just so you guys have an idea of what you're getting the fresh beef and fresh veal just came in so we're gonna show you guys we have the fresh beef share available in 10 pound portions on frankiesrangemeat.com and the fresh veal is available in five pound portions literally just processed a day ago as fresh as it gets we have shown you guys the beef before here we have some coarse ground beef. You're gonna get about four pounds of this. We have a round roast. You guys are gonna get one roast, which is one, one and a half pounds. One portion of brisket, about a pound as well. And then either a ribeye steak or it's going to be a porterhouse steak with the package. And then we have some kind of like neck chops and shanks. You're gonna get one pound of those. And then you're gonna get a uh, rib portion as well, totaling to 10 pounds. So uh, expect three to four pounds of ground beef, two to three pounds of roast, and then one to two pounds of steaks with the fresh beef share. And then we have the veal, which is slightly lighter in color. Uh, you guys can tell it still looks a little bit dark. That's because this is genuine mother's milk fed veal. So it's gonna be two pounds of ground veal. We're gonna give you guys one or two of the steaks. We have some veal shanks and veal ribs as well. We have some veal brisket. And then we have some veal round roasts. This looks really, really cool. I'm gonna be excited to make stew from these. Nice, you know, kind of like dark pink meat. This is a little milder tasting than beef. And uh, you know, less iron, less, uh, minerals overall it's a little bit easier on digestion the color difference is a lot more apparent when you put them side by side so veal versus beef also just got all of the fresh dairy and you guys have been placing orders over the last day or two for the kefir kefir is good in the fridge actually for about two weeks but uh, the milk is really only good for about a week so we're shipping most of the milk out today guys and we also just got some of the butter as well as cream back in stock if you guys want the fresh straight from the farm a2a2 grass-fed dairy products we have butter cream milk kefir that we're showing you guys here and then we also have the yogurt the cottage cheese and the farmer's cheese still in the fridge so we actually sold out of the fresh beef share uh, so some of you guys are going to get like 10 pounds of veal instead of beef so you guys are getting a pretty good deal on the uh on the meat all right guys so i couldn't wait to try this veal so i just threw a ribeye chop into the pan with some salt on it still uh really rare on the inside basically raw
it's like really mild because it's so fresh yeah so if you guys have never had fresh meat before since the animal isn't aged it doesn't really develop much flavor so this is just really really fresh and really plain and because the veal is younger beef it's a little bit less minerally and really really nice i mean veal is my favorite meat it's just you know the access to like really high quality veal is limited so happy to have this and uh definitely let me know if you guys have the fresh veal share how you like it after you try it out yeah this is really good so that's the main new thing we have in this week and i don't really know if we're going to have a veal share in the future because uh just having animals that young on that high of a quality of feed is just it just doesn't happen so this might be the only chance for the next few months or year who knows uh, if you guys do want to try the veal out but we will have the more affordable beef share hopefully in two or three weeks so we have pre-orders now it's going to be a hundred dollars for 10 pounds of fresh beef delivered to your door uh, that's going to ship out on the 26th of april wednesday or uh, if we're ready sooner if we have more pre-orders we'll ship it out the week earlier so if it was a little expensive for you guys uh, this next time around we're going to do it a little more affordable so into our freezer show you guys some restocks so last week we ran out of the bivet steaks and the flat iron steaks but we do have them now these are nice uh, half pound packages of four ounce portion steaks so you know very very convenient the main restocks this week are some of our grinds so we have the 95.5 lean blend back available i'll actually roll another clip of this uh, just to show you guys how lean it is uh, when it's actually being ground up and uh, as usual we do have the organ grind now back available we did restock our lamb stomach and we should actually be getting beef tripe uh, hopefully in the next week or two that's going to be a first ground wagyu we showed you guys this last week pretty fatty 70 30. and we have the best burger blend back in stock too uh, we made it a little more affordable this time around uh, we had some ribeye trimming some short rib just really really high quality steak cuts that we put in here We've always had the boneless lamb leg and we also restocked some of the bone in lamb leg. I actually planned on doing a big sale for Easter, but uh, I was a little too late, missed the, uh, missed the holiday this year. But we have plenty of bone in lamb legs now. Yeah, nothing too crazy. I don't think anything is like uh, brand new, uh, but we did restock a decent amount of stuff on the website if you guys have been waiting for anything. So the only non-meat restock this week is probably the chocolate chip cookies being back so we have the Tatomi's dark chocolate cookies maybe we'll have time to do the white chocolate uh, this week we have the vanilla best bars we have plenty of the pemmican available we have the chocolate best bars we have the berry best bars uh, we are missing the banana rice crisp bars which are going to be quinoa crisp uh, in the next uh, week or two hopefully we can make those this weekend as well some of the biltong is still available, some of the beef sticks, but we are running low on those as well. And I guess one thing I'm a little excited about is we're going to do the teriyaki jerky again with uh, just a different recipe. Uh, I'm making them slice the beef before putting it in the marinade, which is going to be a little more work, but uh, there should be a lot more flavor with like the coconut aminos, the ginger, the garlic, the honey. Should, should be really, really delicious. Hopefully that turns out good. If not, I'm going to lose my mind. What else do I have to do? Also had another creative idea. So you guys know we currently have the steak seasoning. So this is salt, pepper, onion, garlic, mushroom. I really like this on potatoes and vegetables, actually more than steak. Uh, so I was thinking we can do a, a New York City steakhouse style blend, uh, which is really just gonna be a, a special ratio of fresh salt and pepper. So uh, maybe we'll try that out uh, and see how you guys like it. I'm gonna test it out first. Yeah, cause you guys know like New York City is famous for uh, it's the steak houses and I, I used to work in them, you know, I mean almost 10 years ago now, but uh, I got a few tips from the chefs. I guess we'll have to try it out and see if it's worth a, its own product. And if you guys missed it every week now, we are getting in the fresh egg and dairy delivery. So like all this dairy in the fridge here right now, we're going to toss it tomorrow and then uh, we'll get the fresh stuff in on Thursday, Wednesday from the Amish farmers. So if you guys do want uh, milk, butter, cream, it should all be restocking uh, the day this video is posted. Uh, I'm not going to talk about the other business today, Oregon Supplements, Wi-Fi Shielding, Frankie's Naturals. Everything's going uh, fairly smoothly. We might do some uh, restocks on Wi-Fi Shielding and then uh, maybe get someone to do some more creative and like machine-involved cosmetics for the natural stuff. And then uh, we still have that product that I wanted to launch. It was supposed to be here already. 
but maybe it'll be ready in the next like two or three weeks. So it's actually nothing new, but it's just like a little riff on something we've been doing. So I'm a little excited for that. But as always, thank you guys for joining me. Uh, just to sum things up for this week, big price reduction on the eggs. Uh, we do have the fresh veal share available right now, which is really, really special. We showed those clips earlier. Uh, the more affordable beef share is going to go out in two or three weeks and uh, just being consistent with all the dairy products. And then we should have some uh, new stuff available as well within the next two or three weeks, uh, especially the, the beef stomach. So you guys can go to frank where you will see all of my businesses, especially Frankie Strange Meat and Frankie Strange Foods. I don't think I told you guys, uh, we got the apple, lemon, water kefir back in stock now, ginger, lime. Guys, I've been double checking all the water kefir. It's ideal probiotic content. Should be 100%. Uh, perfect for you guys when you get it. If not, just email me and we can work something out. Yeah, I, I said we got, the, we got the cookies back in stock and we should be able to do the white chocolate cookies as well as the quinoa crisp bars. And every time we make these guys, I, I refine the recipes a little bit more. So uh, the cookies are pretty much at where they're going to stay. I think they're really good now. The flavor, the texture, the quality of the ingredients is excellent. And I'm looking forward to trying the quinoa crisp this weekend. So thanks again, guys frank to check everything out, and we'll see you guys soon.